welcome back to Let's Play Mad Max. I'm Burning Dog Face, and someday I am going to jump that canyon. Today is not that day. We are instead heading off. In my unstoppable war machine. Collect a piece of the survey crew for Pink Eye. I think he's still got the Holy Ranch on him. It's not sure that's the one he uses. Huh. Why don't I just. Oh, because it's pointing at the bridge. Yeah. Death! Reach out and touch somebody. Ooh, my frame rate just took a hit. Ooh, he didn't enjoy that. Not even a little bit. I forgot what I was doing immediately. Flame pipes, war crier, thunder sticks. This is no good. No good. Crazy. Well, shit. You best have some good advice for me. And if the good advice is don't do it, I'm not going to be pleased. You, wasteland walker. You got the looks of a warrior about you. I can tell you this much. The camp there, warlord Scrotus property, has three big pumps working day and night. If you try your way inside, silence their war cryer first, or the fight's gonna get mighty tough. But hear me, the right of the entrance, there's another way inside. Smaller, less dangerous. Havoc Point, a well-defended camp with three pumps working for oil. A good amount of loot can be found inside. Look for a secret way into the right of the entrance. Tight perimeter defenses, lots of explosives. Watch out for chain reactions. Well, time to live dangerously. Although, if we're gonna fucking do this, then we're gonna fucking do this. Oh man, my handling is garbage right now. Jesus. Why would you put those back on? Are you insane? Look how terrible they look. At it. <laughs> Live dangerously. It's been an honor working with you. No. Ah, oh, damn it. I 
thought it couldn't hit me down here. Or they're being directly above me and all. Oh, I don't think it can. Take that thing down. I'm gonna a little bit harder this time. That did not fill me with confidence. Get out there and fix it. My black fingers itch for sacred work. He's doing most of the work, honestly, when we're in combat. Oh, I suppose, you know, just keeping the car straight in uh, the middle of a deathmatch is uh, difficult enough. So fine, I won't give Max shit for that. Oh, my organs. Oh, he can't hit us from here. Nice. Thank you, chum. Oh, dear. Now they know we're coming. Because of this ridiculous paint job, and because of all the mayhem I have just wrought. This is the entrance to the right she was talking about. It wasn't like around the corner of the building. Uh. I'm just gonna check. Or just to set my mind at ease. Nope. Didn't even slow down. Check out why all the towers are gone. See if I can get these guys. Oh. How dare you? Oh dear. Speaking of pain reactions. Uh 
Oh. Let me check something. Uh, there you are. Huh. I was just wondering if it's just gonna infinitely spawn dudes until it took care of that guy. All right, all right. Oh. How many stars is this place? Wrong area. Oh, yeah, that would do it then. Spot for this. You uh, jibbed your friend there. Just FYI, I don't know if you caught that. He sure is fucked, dude. Maybe this isn't the fight to do that. Okay, so now you, now that kicks in, huh? Okay. Oh, damn it. I rolled towards him instead of... I wanted to throw the thing at him. Damn it, now I have to kill all those guys all over again. Oh, the pain. Hate. 
What if there are any lower level uh, camps left? There gotta be water around here somewhere. Your canteen is almost full, dude. And it didn't even replenish all my junk. Oh, hey, everybody's dead. That's an unexpected surprise. other guys go. I haven't completed anything, technically. Smells like victory. Oh, look, I walked right past one. A bonus shiv. Except I already had one shiv, so I don't know what that's about. Since, you know, it didn't give me one. Mine! One of two. Goddamn. What could the project parts even be for that? A map and a compass? Thank you, Jesse. Almost disappointed I didn't get the chance to uh, redeem myself from that fight. Almost. No insignia is hidden in stupid places. Three things taken out at once. Oh, Scrotus is gonna be mad about that. You know, I was thinking, sometimes when, uh... Sometimes when I go to meet with Griffa, your boy, uh... Chum says this. Something I have to do here. I'll just wait here with my able hands, huh? While the leathery stranger waddles out into the wasteland to speak to the hosts, it's perfectly normal. Everybody does. <laughs> I recorded that the last time I uh, went to see Griffa. I just didn't use that bit in the actual video. So that would be nice to open on Griffith's metaphilosophical rambling. So that's part of what, you know, makes me wonder if uh, Griffa even exists at all. You know, maybe he's, uh... A figment of Max's imagination, but what if he's right when he says, you know, going out there and talking to ghosts? What 
What if it's not a figment of Max's imagination? What if it's all that's left of someone else's? I don't think they really have anything like that in the Mad Max, uh... ...setting, but I'm reminded of a thing I heard about, uh... ...the, uh, the Metro series. You know, Metro 2033 and its sequels. That, uh... Apparently the game has these shadow people in it. You know, basically ghosts. And nobody knows where they come from, but one of the in-universe theories about it is apparently this idea that, uh... Well, I should mention that, uh, like this game, Metro is a, is a post-apocalypse story. The idea is that the surface is all messed up, so, uh... The surviving population of Moscow moved into the subway system beneath the city. guy in game who tells you that some people say I'm going white here that the uh I'm a protector saint but don't be long please that when the apocalypse came heaven and hell were destroyed along with the uh with the surface so when people die they just stick around Not very good timing I think I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Mad Max. Whether or not we talk to any ghosts, I haven't decided yet. Later.